what we have here today is Microsoft working together with government and a broad range of innovators uh, from the community to really promote open government, open data and open source. The Open Government Partnership is a partnership between civil society organizations and governments of various countries. South Africa, being one of the founding members, remains on the steering committee and in October this year, on the 28th, we take over as the lead chain. So as you can see, there are lots of people who are involved. They had 48 hours to develop these creative solutions to start a dialogue and a conversation around what this data means. We've been given an opportunity to expose our government data to the public. Statistics and something could actually, in fact, they could actually save someone's life. In terms of our idea, it is based on using Census 2011 data and we wanted to present it in a new way and in a fun way. We created a Twitter bot that randomly fires or tweets using that census data. The aim of the application is to make people aware of whether the places and areas they frequent are safe to be in or not. We are using the data to highlight one issue around child-led households in South Africa. It's a web scraper basically for JSTOR. I'm using all the metadata to try and produce new data and relationships that aren't necessarily true, but they're like logically coherent. We have set ourselves the goal to see if we can use the data that's available to predict areas where there will either be service delivery protests or possibly even xenophobic violence in the future. We're creating a, a product and a service called Fatty. The product will be a device that is able to find the nearest Wi-Fi hotspot. We created a, a, a thing called Pointer, which is essentially a smart street science system. Wits University has half a block of buildings up the road, and we're turning that into a digital innovation hub, which we call it Simolochong Precinct, where we can help people and support people who want to build their own ideas, their own innovations. 